Hi, welcome to today's haul. So this is from Right Stuff's winter sale. I believe this was from week six, so this is not the package in my buy with me video. I didn't film this one because I was away from home and I was just on my phone and I think I just picked up a couple of the leftover things. I think there's a pre-order in here, all kinds of stuff. So I'm excited to open this because I'm not quite sure what's in here, but I'm excited to find out. So the box is a little beat up. So hopefully everything is okay inside. So first we have volumes nine and seven of Hunter Hunter. Just continuing to pick up any volumes I see. I'm trying to do it kind of in order. And I just saw that these came back in stock, so I picked these up. I always love the spines of Hunter Hunter. They, I feel like they're gonna look so nice all laid out because they're so colorful. So next we have volume 5 of Blank Canvas. I have volumes 1 through 4 and I was waiting to get this one in to start it because these are so thin. I know I'm going to fly through them really fast. So I'm excited to have the last one so I'll definitely be reading this. This is a autobiographical manga by the author of Princess Jellyfish and other works. So yeah, I really enjoy their art and their works, so I'm pretty sure I will enjoy this. And then next we got volume 2 of Blue Period. I haven't started this yet, but I have heard such high praises of this, so I wanted to wait until I got the second one to start it. But I'm really excited about this. I know the releases for this are pretty quick. I know 3 and 4 are already coming out like in... I think February and then April, so yeah, and I, I believe they have some kind of license for this now, so it might be getting an anime, don't quote me, but yeah, I'm really excited about this. I just know it's about art in high school, so yeah. And then next we got volume one of Sunny. This is not part of the sale, this is I bought full price, but if you saw my last haul, I got volumes two through four. So I have a good chunk of this to start reading, and this is by Taya Matsumoto, and I believe it's about a group of orphans traveling in a car named Sunny and this kind of has like a slight misprint if you can see part of the covers on the spine which is kind of annoying but you know what can you do I bought more than I thought I didn't <laughs> so these were part of the sale I got I hear the sunspot theory of happiness I believe this is the sequel to I hear the sunspot and then I hear the sunspot limit I think this is like the third installment and there's going to be three volumes of this. I've read the first volume of this and I really enjoyed it and I'm glad they continued the series and it's about a man with hearing problems and his relationship with this other man and kind of just navigating through a relationship with someone who has a disability. So I think this is a really nice series and I'm excited to keep going with this. And then here is, I hear the sunspot limit 2, and I think I just saw that limit 3 is coming out in April or March. Lastly, I got 7 days. I was meaning to pick this up when it first came on sale, but then I decided against it, and then I just decided to pick it up. This one, I just heard that it was plagiarized by some movie or show, so I wanted to support the original creators. And I believe this is about, like, a guy who will date someone for a week and then dump them, and it's he never, like, gets into a long-term relationship, and this guy is trying to change that or something like that. I don't know. I heard it's pretty cute, so it's not explicit. It's just rated teen, so yeah. So that is what I got. Thank you for watching. I know this was a quick haul, but I'm still waiting for my large, large package to come. I don't know when it will, but definitely what I'm going to start reading first is Blank Canvas, Sunny, and then the first two volumes of Blue Period, and then Hunter x Hunter. I'm still waiting for a few of the earlier volumes to start reading. And then I hear the sunspot. I'm probably going to save for a later day, and then seven days is going to be when I feel like reading just a one-shot, which I've been doing more often lately. In my next reading log, you'll see that I read a lot of one-shots this month. So yeah, thank you for watching, and bye! Since this video is a little short, I figured I'd film some putting away stuff in my shelves, but my shelves are so full right now, I need to rearrange some things, so these are the volumes of Hunter x Hunter I have. I feel like when I get more of these, it's gonna look so nice, but also I'm getting like 20 more volumes of Heike, so I don't know where I'm gonna put those.
definitely going to need to do another reorganizing video because this bottom shelf is kind of just like the overflow shelf. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore.